Hey guys, welcome back. Mac React here. We're going to get into our last episode of Love, Death, and Robots. If y'all watched with us this far, thank you so much for tuning in with us. This has been a super awesome series. We've been waiting for it for a while. And we're so glad we could crank these videos out for y'all to watch. So, thanks you guys. Give yourself a pat on the back. Yep. It's all because of y'all. This one's called The Drowned Giant. Ooh. Body of a colossal young man washes ashore and becomes an object of fascination for the locals. What? So it doesn't sound like anything scary is going to happen. Just Aquaman seems, showing up. This one seems kind of <laughs> weird. There was a weird one in season one. The one with Topher Grace. Oh. Where there's like a civilization in the freezer. In the freezer, in the right freezer. Like every yeah. Every time they yeah. look, it like is getting bigger and better. Yeah. Um, I wonder if this is going to be like the weird one for this season. Mm. You know what? First season, I thought the weird one was when the yogurt attacked. That one was weird too. That one was weird <laughs> yeah, that too. That one was weird too. Um, well, season one was, I think, 16 or 18 episodes, so they had a lot more diversity. In and that's way. that's literally what I was about to say, too, because they had more episodes to work with. So who knows? Maybe if those other episodes do come out, we might actually we can see judge the entire season two in, in its entirety. Yes, yes. Well, guys, you waited this long. Let's get into this last episode. Let's do it. Ooh. A penis? <laughs> There was a yeah, penis? That's what it looked like. That's a penis! <laughs> oh my god. Why? Whoa, that looks real. Okay, another like ultra realistic one. We finally decided to investigate for ourselves. Come on then, Steven. Whoa. Oh shit. There's a human on the beach. <laughs> mm -hmm. Maybe the twist is there he's regular and they're small. That looks crazy. It was a noble face, possessed of an ornate charm that is he dead? I think so, yeah. His lips are purple. Dang, Whoa. there's fish in his is that his palm? Yeah, it's his hand. Wow, this is crazy. Don't go walk on his is dead body. Is there one crawl all over him? What the hell? That's gross. Y'all are animals. That's really weird. <laughs> this one's weird. <laughs> Where the hell did he come from? Right? I'm not gonna like it when he starts decaying. Maybe you're right. Maybe they're small. And he's normal. <laughs> well, everything around them looks normal, though, so I don't think that's it. <laughs> You're just blatantly littered. Yeah. Ew. Late afternoon, hoping that I'd find fewer people on the beach. Ew, he looks so gross now. Doesn't it smell bad by now? I don't know. Three days? Prolonged immersion in sea. I wonder if he died before he hit the beach or I just want to know where the hell he came from. Oh, we're not going to find that out. Somebody made a sandcastle on top of him? Yeah. What is, is that? Is that an arm? This new perspective for which all our finite lives are destined. There's a cigarette butt in his eye. Oh my god. More tragic by the others, but the first of a series of depredations. These had passed. Struggled to overcome my reluctance to witness the end of this magnificent illusion. This is Hail Satan. Has the <laughs> Somebody wrote that on his leg. Yeah, I found almost with relief that the head had been removed. Dang, that's metal. Ugh. What is that? Weeks elapsed before my next journey to the beach. Giant had vanished. 
Ugh. Doesn't it smell bad? I'm sure it does, yeah. That's cool. That's a cool butcher shop thing. I have no doubt that if I searched the town's pubs, hotels, and eateries, I'd also find the mummified nose or ears of the giant hanging on. Dude, they have the skull. How did they get his skull? Right? Focus. Travels up and down the northwest coast. That's his. That's his penis. Yeah. Apparatus, stunning in its proportions and once potency, occupies a complete tent to itself. That was why it was in the house. Yeah. Belonging to a whale, a large sea beast. But the wow. giant is still alive from a return journey to the sea. This is so weird. It's cool though. Well, that one was super like artsy, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. That one just seemed very existential crisis to me. Like. Yeah, it seemed like they were really trying to like say something, um, like about humans and the way we treat things but at the same time it didn't really feel like it fit as well as the other episodes did mm -mm. that being said i still liked it i did too it was just a weird um hearing the guy like talk throughout it yeah there was one thing he said that just really resonated with me like because in the beginning he kept idolizing the giant and like wow his angelic features and this and that and then literally as people started graffitiing on him he was just like once more and more of that started happening, he almost looked more human to me. And I was like, you know, because of all of our errors and everything. I could see what they were trying to do with it. You know, you're right. It was very artsy. What What did they do with all his, like, body parts and stuff? He said some of it ended up, like, in, like, above the butcher shop and stuff, but... Sounds like they got sold on the black market. I guess so. You know, just whatever government was I there. I have so many questions now. Like, where did he come from? Are there more of him? <laughs> If so, are they going to come kill us all? Because they're giant. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's crazy. Like, where did he come from? Like, how did he get washed Maybe up there? Maybe he was a regular sized guy that, like, grew big or something. I don't know. I don't know. And was he dead before he hit the shore? Yeah, it didn't or? seem like he was in a fight or anything. His body didn't have any bruises or, like, abrasions on it. It looked like he just drowned. Yeah. It's weird. It is weird. Um, I think my top three is still the same, though. What would be your top three? Snow in the desert, then ice, and then the Michael B. Jordan one, what was it called? Life Hutch, mm -hmm. and Tall Grass. I had to add Tall Grass in there because I really I really like that one, it scared me. <laughs> My top three I think are the same. I think ice first, and then uh, snow in the desert, and then Life Hutch would yeah. probably be my top three. Yeah, I, I had to mention Tall Grass because I feel like Life Hutch and Tall Honorable Grass. Honorable mention, are, yeah. Yeah, they're like tied. Um, there were only eight episodes, like we said, so it's kind of hard to, I guess, treat it like season one because there was so much more in season one. Right. But they wanted us to get this now, so they were like, okay, half now, maybe half later. Which I'm, I'm not. not sure. I'm, I'm not mad about it. I definitely have missed Love, Death, and Robots. Mm -hmm. I want to see if any of the animators or animation studios that that were in season one did some of these season two episodes because i swear some of the animation styles seemed the same yeah from some things that were season one right um so i'm gonna go look that up after this is done that'll be <laughs> really I'm interesting curious. Yeah. i'm just curious about that i just like anthology series too just yeah series where it's like every episode is different like black yeah. mirror or uh, twilight zone yep. stuff like that i dig that stuff like where i don't have to like watch every episode in order to make mm -hmm. sure i know what's going on yeah, yeah i agree with that i agree with that well i really hope they do come out with more episodes me I, too i really want to see more if we're not going to get more season two then i just hope they do a bigger better season three i'm fine with that too no matter how long it takes it takes a couple years just get it done <laughs> well guys that's gonna do it for us uh we watched all eight episodes in two days we're gonna release them on youtube in maybe like a week's time um kind of spread them out a little bit if you watched all of them with us, thank you guys so much. Thank you. You guys are the best. Um, let us know down below in the comment section which were your favorite three. And you could even rank them one, two, three if you'd like to. Uh, we're just kind of interested to see how our interests align with you guys. Yeah, true. Um, and if you want to see more of this content, you know what to do. Leave a like, subscribe, 
and we're gonna see you guys in the next one peace out y'all bye